Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh okay. now I want to ask you something about uh, a sort of serendipitous moment in Home Alone. What's up? What do you want? We, it's in Larry's camera shop. Oh. oh. Well, hell, here, give me that. Yeah. Are you going to have one? I'm going to have one. You yes, should. We should all Larry have is some. enjoying a Triscuit <laughs> cracker right now. <laughs> I could join I'm, some you know, I, it's about time. It's been how many years since Billy Madison? You're finally sharing your Triscuit cracker. <laughs> <laughs> it would be apropos. I'm going to have two. If you, thanks for sharing your delicious Triscuit crackers. What were you going to ask before? I you? was just going to ask about Home Alone because there's something that happens in your scene as you're on the phone uh, when oh. the donut falls on the on the phone, which was obvious, <laughs> which was obviously an accident, donut. right? Yep. Um, <laughs> That's what happened. It fell apart. Yep. Every yep. time I touch a donut, it falls apart. I have that visual of you sort of, you know, apathetic. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> there it is. I'm just, <laughs> and there it falls. An apathetic. <laughs> <laughs> like this apathetic, like whatever. What do you want, ma'am? And the donut falls apart. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. I, well, I, I, there's, a, there's a story to that. We're eating donuts, with Larry yeah. Hagan, mm -hmm. Officer Balzac. We're eating donuts, with Officer Balzac, right now. Um. <laughs> <laughs> mm, so good. Yeah. Um, how many that donuts taste did the you? Same? How many donuts? Oh, did you good yeah, question. That's, that's the story. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. Here's the thing. Daniel, uh, uh, Daniel, what was that guy's name? Uh, who, who was with Joe Pesci? Oh, oh uh, Stern. Daniel, Daniel Stern. Yeah. Yeah. He. Um, Don't mind if I do. Yeah. I get a call. I get a call from my uh, agent saying, uh, "Larry, uh, uh, they're making a, a, another movie, Home Alone, and uh, they want you to be in it." Daniel Stern is the co-star. He signed to do it. He's giving them a lot of problems with the money. So they don't think they're going to go along with it. And they want to re replace them, and they want to replace them with you. Wow. So, but th this is an emergency. He's, you know, he's there in Chicago. They're, they've already started shooting. They're going to have to reshoot a lot of stuff. So what the deal is, you got to pack your bags um, you may have to take a flight out tonight, but the negotiation is still going on. Uh, Daniel is still in the in the mix, so pack your bags, put it behind the couch, and wait for me to call you back. And I said, okay, you because you may have to get on a plane tonight. I said, okay, fine. About a couple hours later, he calls me back. He says, okay, Daniel caved. He's going to go for less money. You're not going to be in it. Uh, Okay, fine. Thank you. Uh, so I uh, forgot about it. About two, three, about three weeks later, I get a call from my agent again. He said, "Hey, they want to talk to you." So I go, "Okay." So they patch me in, and the producers are saying, "Larry, listen, we really feel bad about what we did to you. You know, mm. getting you all excited, and then Daniel comes in." So. We don't have any, we, so we want you as part of the movie. We, we really do figure we, we owe you. But there's no parts left except this small uh, 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 policeman. Uh, so it's such a small part, and the, uh, it's the only part open. We want you part of the movie. We don't want to insult you by giving you this small part. So I'll tell you what, we'll pick you up with a limousine take you there, you drop you off in a limousine, bring you back in a limousine, blah, 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 first class plane ticket, and we'll pay you for a half a day's work, $10,000. Is that okay? And I said, you bet. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah. Let, I'm not let insulted me think about at it. all. Yeah. Okay, right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was highly insulted, and now I am not. Now it's gone. Yeah, now it's totally cool. <laughs> I would have done it for two, yeah. for two grand in a tax. <laughs> <laughs> but since you suggest a limo yeah. in 10K, I'll, I'll do it. I was yeah. thinking more of $20,000. <laughs> but no, I said, uh, fine. So they, they flew me there. You know, first class has limo, white limo. A white oh, limo. that's fancy. Wow. That's, that's full on like late eighties, early nineties yeah, class. Yeah, yeah. That's prom. You were probably going to prom. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
So they drive me there. So then, you know, they, they take me there. And then the first thing they say is they take me to the set immediately, you know, from the cab they, uh, or the limo. They take me to the set. And they say, okay, we're going to shoot. We've already set up for you, so you're ready to go. Uh, this is the costume. This is the set. Uh, do you want anything? Uh, I said, well, you know, what am I doing? He said, well, all, all you're doing is you're going to be talking on the telephone to the, the, his mom. I said, okay. He said, do you want anything? I said, oh, yeah, well, give me a donut. I want, I want to eat a donut. It's great. So they say, okay, so go get dressed, make up, stuff like that, and come back here. So I go get dressed, make up and stuff. I come back, and they have got a bakery <laughs> wheeling thing of donuts. There must have been 100 donuts in there. On trays. Glazed yeah. donuts. Yeah. 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 They yeah. have that, and it's all filled. And it's I like go, they robbed a hotel, <laughs> <laughs> right? Or a bakery, or an or actual something. bakery. <laughs> yeah. So I go, oh, I'm, you know, they're all glazed. <clears throat> and they say, oh, okay, well, we got you your donuts. I go, well, thank you very much. Okay, so I, I do it, you know, and I, I eat the donut. No big deal. I'm just eating a donut and talking on the telephone. No dropping. No nothing. And the camera, and it was on a dolly, if you realize mm -hmm. it's going like this. Mm -hmm. The dolly kept screwing up. And if it wasn't a dolly, then it was a sound. But they did it 10 times, mm. you know, that, that one scene, and not because of me. Um, but each time I had it, I got a, a new donut, <laughs> you know, because I only took like two bites out right. of each time. Yeah. Right. But I did eat 10 It keeps donuts. falling apart. That's right. <laughs> no, no, it never fell apart. It never fell apart. I was just eating 10, uh, take two bites out of a donut, talk, and then they would say, oh, we have to do it again. Give yeah. me another donut. Two bites out of the donut, talk. Oh, we gotta do it again. I'm eating a donut. I do the scene, and the director says, cut, and everybody falls down laughing. And I said, what, what, what's going on? And they said, look at the microphone. Here they come. Do you hear the cops? Oh, yeah, there's the cops now. <laughs> uh, or, uh, yeah, because I had, didn't I have one of these kind of um, um, things? That, no, it was, it was, it was a, a telephone. Yeah, it was a telephone. It was yep. a handheld telephone. Yes, they said, well, look at the phone. Yeah. And I looked at the phone, and there was this thing stuck to it. <laughs> and I didn't know it, and the director didn't stop the cut. Uh, that's great. And he said, when he said cut, he said right away. So that's the one we're taking. That's, that's awesome. the one we're using. Was Hughes directing that scene, or was it like a second unit or no he was directing it but there was nothing to direct yeah uh, the the only thing that was it was the cinematographer or the camera operator mm -hmm. would say uh that jiggled or there got was it. a bump but it had nothing to do with directing or or me they just said larry do it again and i go why it's a you know lights thing yeah or, or camera and then the last one it just happened and he says we're using that one That's it was great. the last take that, no, that was the last oh, wow. thing. Well, that, he ended it. I mean, yeah. that was the oh. only good take. Right, right, right. There was 10 bad ones, and then he said, we'll use that. I think you're probably one of the few people, I could be way off, that you auditioned for a, a, a role, and you didn't get it, but they bring you back to play the role in a, in a different role for Seinfeld, right? I mean, you originally auditioned to be Kramer. Is that correct? Yeah. And so then, you, you you don't get the role for the run, but they brought oh, but right. they brought you back in the finale to right. play Kramer within a Kramer. <laughs> what was that like? Well, I'm interested. Yeah, I'm yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? Uh, <laughs> Where are we? <laughs> <laughs>